hello welcome back to another video and today is gonna be interesting why well i'll tell you why because i'm gonna be taking you guys through an interesting journey and that journey is my tumblr archive now as of how can i see when was the last time that i posted fucking stupid ass quick time I'm thinking of moving. Maybe it will actually happen now. I think it is now recording. I'm not entirely sure, but let me see. How do I see when was the last time that I posted? Like, I can see my posts that I've reblogged, and it's honestly, I'm not even afraid to admit that I've been using Tumblr recently. Maybe not this month, maybe not last month, but I've been using it, like, this year. It's just, like, gotten to a point where every other app does not satisfy me anymore. I can see that I have many posts and I can see that I have a thousand and nine hundred eleven, nine eleven posts. That is, if that's not a cry for help, then I don't know what is. That's a sign from the divine. I already have this open, which is my vlog, but here's the thing. I was like, I was, I'm like a hacker. I know code. Just kidding. But I did edit my Tumblr theme a while back when I actually used this thing to like just show the posts that I have tagged with um, hashtag S because aesthetics, I keep forgetting I need to look this way and not this way. I'm sorry. Artsy people will get this. Uh, it's pretty, honestly, it's pretty cool. I will follow myself. And I literally one time I got like... I think it was last year, or I don't know when, but it was kind of recently too, that I wanted to check my Tumblr, and that one time I hadn't even logged in in like, since probably 2014, 2015, and I logged in and it was full of like spam with like porn posts, and then I had like a DM that said something like, hey, not too scary or anything, but like, uh, I just thought your activity was like kind of weird, I've been following you, and it doesn't seem like the usual thing that you used to post, so I don't know if you've gotten hacked or something, and then, but like, the account seemed kind of weird, and I was like, who are you? And I think they left like a link, and I'm not, like, I'm stupid, but I'm not that stupid, you know? So I didn't click the link, but I did notify Tumblr. I think they sent me something like, we're gonna delete your account, permanently and I got panicked because believe it or not even though I do not use this a lot for like how I used to use it before I still use it when I need inspiration for illustrations or for like video ideas for looks and it I don't know I just like hold a very special place in my heart for Tumblr but let's get to the juicy stuff I guess I'm gonna check, first of all, let's see this. I'm gonna go to my about, but I know this is gonna be so cringy. Also, cause like I be updating this shit and then I put like the date when I when it was like last updated. I don't know, like every year I will turn like, oh, now I'm 24, now I'm 26. And I will like first thing in the morning, I will go to my Tumblr and I will update. Um, but clearly I didn't update it this year cause it says I'm 25 and I'm 26 now. So I guess the last update of this about me is gonna be like last year. Um, this is terrifying, but let me click. Blog contains explicit content. I used to try and tag everything, but I really don't anymore. Yeah, that's hard. Um, I can't just be like tagging everything, like um, teeth content warning, eye content warning. Like, I'm sorry, I just don't do that anymore. Paulina, 25, Mexico. I'm 26 now. I'm still from Mexico. She, her. Yeah, I'm still a she, her. And I'll look like this, not the selfie page, please. Okay, I haven't updated this in a while too. <sighs> okay, that's kinda... Three years ago, that's the last time I posted a selfie here. Okay, babes. Zero notes, so I was not a Tumblr babe. In my heart I was, that's what I wanted, like for sure. Oh, she's quirky. Mm. I don't wanna go that far down because it's gonna get weird but i should maybe i should these are like a lot of these are still on my instagram so like um, it's not that bad okay anyway whatever we're not here to see my face and then i have like my zodiac placements nobody gives a fuck quirky quote art major a quiet kid blah blah, blah. okay mostly on twitter i have testimonials 
last updated april 24th 2020 what did i tell you it's not on my birthday but it's still on my month she keeps it updated brought to you by our sponsors paulina prince of mexico oh uh, these are all old mutuals from twitter a lot of these i don't remember where they are like we probably unfollowed each other already paulina's fan club ew the picture i thought i served look at this <laughs> this wing can i make it bigger this wing my nose looks like a cheeto i didn't even try to show my top lip eyebrows never done what's that the ugliest wing okay we got enough of that pepe paulin wow paulina you're so mexican it's almost like you're from mexico i love paulina wow i'm this is all like i'm really stroking my ego I needed to make sure that I had this so everyone could see that I was not like I had a couple friends online. But what kind of like narcissist, what level of narcissism do you even have to have to have a testimonial page where people, where you like screenshot tweets of people talking about you? And I will still do it again. Everything's my fault. <laughs> okay. I'm someone's spirit animal. Paulina tweeting about pooping. What a fun Saturday night. Yeah, and I still do that. Consistency. Paulines. Paulina. I think I followed Paulina when she was Pringle 6. I, I had, like, my share of a little bit disturbing usernames on Twitter, but I hold all of them very dear to my heart. They're all very special to me still, and it's part of, like, my history. <sighs> Milky's Not. That was also one of my usernames. Her icon being a small child with Milky's Not. Ew, terrifying. Somebody called the FBI. Paulina, you're trash. Yes, I agree. Paulina is dad, and Paulina is love, and I love you. I love you still. Death. <laughs> Paulina is trash that still needs to be landed. Paulina, Paul, a Paul, you're a shoulder. I love Pauline. Is Paulina okay? No, I'm not. I hope Paulina's internet goes out for days. Many people around the world hope for this. And y'all are praying for my downfall. That's all I can say. Drum solo, Paulina. You're my top dog. Strum's guitar, Paulina. <laughs> the first person in Paulina's follows is Pete Wentz. Keep that in mind, everyone. That's what will have me taken down in the apocalypse. One of the first, like, five conversations Paulina and I had involved me putting on a sparkly pink cowboy hat and asking her if she was kinky. Weren't we, like, 13? How old was I in 2012? I was, like, I was 17. So I was not that young. But, like, I don't know. I was very... I was kind of online i was underage what the fuck paulina maybe you inherited the blood from your real dad satan and what about it paulina looks like dog but sometimes i do paulina your blog font is terrible i love that people were very honest like people now get cancelled over anything like valentine will get cancelled over this now in a heartbeat but not back in the good old days fellas not back in the good old days i can't believe paulina called me cute twice tonight what is this what is this it's america i mean Honestly, is there anything more American than that? I can't believe I didn't follow Paulina until like an hour ago. Maybe this person... Do I think this person doesn't follow me anymore at all. Turns out she's a memer too. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, I think... I used to follow this person and I really like their tweets, but I think they soft block me. Paulina voice. Billy Joe is a sub, by the way. <sighs> Do I still stand by that? Some of these things, yes. Actually, all of it, yes. I still stand by it. Last updated, February 13th, 2018. That was not too long ago. That's what's creeping me out. Like, all of these are not so long ago. Let me close this. Oh, view all posts. That's where I can see, like, everything. Okay. One month ago, I told you guys, like, I've been... I literally been... Literally September 13th, 2021 at 12, 10 a.m. Now, I know that's sad, but consider the times that we're in. It's not so 
crazy right anyway let me go to what else is there here links about instagram me tax team twitter okay everything else is like i mean i used to have tags for everything it's like who the hell was gonna click on this like everything was perfectly organized and i was really proud of this but let's be honest who really was going to my profile to my blog and clicking the links section and seeing hmm what do i feel like looking at tonight maybe should i click on i kind of feel like reading about classism or cultural appropriation this is the perfect outlet to read about it right nobody was doing that i don't know why i was even doing all of this now let's go to the danger zone i'll see my archive titties okay let's go to like the farthest 2011 that's when i made it what's like the first things that i posted oh my gosh girl okay it's a lot of gifts a lot of gifts Ooh, feelings on and off green day green day green day of course like that's pretty it was gonna happen <laughs> what is this oh no this is so creepy and it's in spanish too i guess i can put the text here oh my gosh girl it's 2021 i'm still not famous but it's cool that you were manifesting that let's go to 2012. ew what is this i wish that just for one day everyone will say exactly what they wanted to say no you don't no you don't you wouldn't have a channel if that's what people did <laughs> see why just why 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 i didn't even watch batman i didn't read any comics about the joker like me after ignoring you hey i just got your text okay okay babes oh i was a sucker for this like there was an era on tumblr where it was like people would take pictures of literally nothing but the quality was good because they just got dslr cameras and i fell for it every time every single time my ass will fall for that shit i will swallow that shit up let's see okay my supernatural era this image is not available in your country how deep i want cute voice wow that says so much about society okay girl let's pretend like you actually did this challenge number 39 don't eat when you're bored work out instead instead have i ever worked out in my life no maybe once or twice i discovered tyler the creator i guess based this was everywhere and i don't know why we liked it so much we were all horse girls the drums i had like two songs by them probably or it's like i used to i still do this i think to this day where it's like i'll check out an artist and i'll try my hardest to like really take in the music and pick which songs i actually like but i mostly just download albums thinking that okay but yeah so basically i will just like download everything and never listen to it again like i listened to it probably that day and then like in that week maybe another one or two times and then i will never listen to that album again so that's probably what happened with most of the indie bands on my phone that i haven't even bothered to delete suck my dick Ooh, i'm some crackers so deep no that's like that says like i don't care about anything dude i reblog oh these were everywhere too i'm too pretty to work 
And then they had like mean quotes. And I would just repost them on Instagram. Yeah, a lot has happened. The internet has definitely changed, evolved. And we have evolved with the times as well, you know? Uh, let's go to like 2016 was definitely a year. See, that's when I was like into my Lana Del Rey type beat. I was already in uni for this. So like I was already trying to be more artsy. I was getting into makeup. No, I was already into makeup. This is cool. A lot of these are cool. I think most of the cringe went away. I was mostly like discovering what I liked. 2018. In 2018, it's like every year I regress into my bandom era. And people try to stop me, but every year I just regress. And I'm like, I need this to comfort myself. To make up for the fact that I haven't like really evolved. I know I just say that we have evolved, but sometimes I just feel like I'm stuck. And I just have to go back to this. And this, like seeing this in one of my worst days, this will make me feel better. This will cheer me up completely. This is what I still have Tumblr, you know? I think we should go back to Tumblr. Like Instagram definitely fell off. TikTok is on speed. Like it's on crack all the time. So we need a little bit of a break from that. <sighs> Twitter is like my toxic boyfriend i don't want to let go of but i need a little bit of a break too every once in a while so let's just bring tumblr back i mean honestly every app is like a recycled version of every other app if you think about it like twitter is a recycled version of tumblr but tumblr is also like recycled version of twitter and then tiktok is definitely like you read a funny tweet and then you make it into a video for the most part. Like, I've seen so many people thinking, like, they ha they're they having, like, an original thought. And then it's like, no, we've seen this, like, 30 times on Twitter. Like, this is very much recycled, babes. And then Instagram is just, like, the biggest joke. Because they want to be everybody else app. So let's just bring Tumblr back. See what's up. I mean, though, Tumblr kind of fell off when they took, like, they removed porn. I'll say that. That's really when the downfall started. But maybe we can give it another chance. I don't know. What do you guys think? Anyway, so yeah, probably the most cringe was like obviously in the couple first years there. But if you want me to make another video like this, um, I'll for sure do it. I don't know. And this also this video was inspired by Brittany Broski's video, obviously, obviously. And yeah, that's pretty much about it. I'm thinking of making this but also with like my TikTok drafts and my Instagram archived posts. And then I'm thinking of also making another one where I search different words on the Twitter search bar and see what comes up. That's risky. So let me know if you like this video. If you want any other video, leave it in the comments. And thank you for watching this. Please like, comment, subscribe, share, um, turn on the notifications, I guess. I don't know. Do whatever you want. It's a free country. Thank you. I love you.